है गाइस अस्सलाम वालेकुम एंड वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल तो आज मैं लेकर आ रही हूँ बहुत ही फेमस रेसिपी सिंगापुर की सिंगापुरियन स्टाइल चिकन साके और मेक श्योर यू वॉच द रेसिपी एंड तक पूरी रेसिपी देखिएगा एंड सेंड मी योर रिक्रिएशन ऑन माई इंस्टा ब्लॉग एंड इफ़ यू आर नॉट फॉलोइंग मी ऑन इंस्टा दैन प्लीज़ गिव मी अ फॉलो देयर and uh, without wasting any time let's start making chicken satay to make singaporean style chicken satay here i have got 700 grams of boneless chicken thigh piece cut into 1 inch cubes i am also going to use 1 teaspoon of minced garlic 1 teaspoon each of turmeric and salt 1 tablespoon each of fennel seeds and cumin seeds crushed I'm going to use 2 to 3 tablespoons of olive oil but if you have peanut oil you can use that as well. So I'm going to start marinating the chicken and I will leave it for 2 to 3 hours. Okay guys so it has been 2 to 3 hours and I'm going to start putting the chicken on the skewers so here I've got bamboo sticks and I'm going to start threading the chicken pieces into the skewers Okay, so I have put five chicken pieces on one skewer. As you can see that I have preheated the oven at 180 degree centigrade and now I'm going to put the chicken skewers in the oven. Okay guys, so the chicken is 80% done and I have turned off the oven and in the meantime I'm going to start making the sauce. and then we have to drizzle the sauce on the chicken and then bake it for another 10 minutes so let's start making the sauce the ingredients you need for sauce are peanut butter chili garlic sauce soya sauce minced garlic vinegar salt and some crushed peanuts so abhi meri beti jo hai she is crushing the peanuts but i am running late so i'm going to start making the sauce To make the peanut sauce here I've got 2 tablespoons of oil. If you have peanut oil you can go ahead and use that. I'm using olive oil. And in this oil I'm adding 1 teaspoon of minced garlic. Next I'm adding peanut butter. So I'm going to use 1 tablespoon of peanut butter. On medium heat keep on stirring and after 2 minutes add rest of the ingredients. I am adding half a teaspoon of salt but you can add according to your taste. And next I'm going to add chili garlic sauce, 3 tablespoons of it. I have reduced the flame now. 
Now I'm going to add a bit of boiling water. Next I'm adding 1 tablespoon of soya sauce. and half a tablespoon of vinegar. I forgot to mention one ingredient before, so you will also need one tablespoon of brown sugar. And now I'm going to let it cook until the sauce thickens. And lastly, I'm adding 2 tablespoons of crushed peanuts. So this is the final consistency of the sauce and now I'm going to drizzle some of the sauce on the chicken pieces and let it cook in the oven for another 10 minutes. I'm just going to drizzle sauce on the chicken. I'm going to turn them around and drizzle some sauce on the other side as well. So guys, I'm going to serve the meal now and I've just made coconut rice in the instant pot and the recipe is coming soon for it so stay tuned.